AI headshot generators are the rage right now. They are the talk of the town. I recently wrote an article that went viral on Google and still gets more than 1000 views every day. People are so curious about this cool new technology of generating stunning AI headshots for yourself that everyone wants to know what the best tool is. And in today's video, I'm going to share about this cool tool called Headshot Pro, which I feel is the best AI headshot generator out there. Don't believe me? Let me give you a glimpse at the results it gave me. I know, I know, I know these pics are stunning and I'll show you how you can get such beautiful headshots for yourself as well. The first step is to go to the description of this video, click on the link Headshot Pro and then follow along on this detailed tutorial. The first step is to go to their website. You can do that by clicking the link on the description of this video. And once you click on generate headshots, this is what you will see. So let's click on, okay, I'm ready. And then we have to capture some selfies with our phone. I've already clicked a few selfies. I will upload them right here. So you need 15 pictures for Headshot Pro to understand how your face looks like and generate some amazing headshots for you. Once all your pictures have been uploaded, you have to click on continue to next step. Then you have to add your personal info. So let's sh start filling out this form. So I have selected all the information that was asked here. Actually, I have tried out so many headshot generators. Headshot Pro is the only one that has asked me my height and my weight. So I think it's going to be able to replicate how my body looks like in real life. Quite an interesting addition here. Then once your uh, a personal data has been uploaded, you have to select some styles. So let's see where I want my pictures to be I would definitely like to have a bookshelf and uh, clothes wow so many options so you can select six styles that means six background and six outfit combinations that's a lot of versatility The one interesting feature to notice here is that Headshot Pro has amazing customization options when it comes to outfits like it has a hijab option, it has a graduation day option, it has an abaya option, it has a graduation robe option, uh, different colors of hijab options which is very versatile and I think it's so inclusive and so I have selected six styles, six outfits and let's go to the next step. You get one final chance to review all the information you submitted regarding your age, your height, your body type and the styles that you selected and also if you wish you can change the photos you submitted if you feel some of them are not good enough you can change them and then you have to click on agree and that you have uploaded the best of your photos and then click on submit. Once you do that, you'll get the message that the process can take up to two hours, but the AI has already started working on creating a custom AI model for you and then you'll get your amazing headshots in about two hours. So my headshots are ready. It took about one hour and this is what I see. Uh, these are all the photos and these are a few photos that I have hearted because I really liked how they look but let's take a look at all the pictures that Headshot Pro generated for me I'm going to enlarge it and show you so this photo as you can see my face looks exactly like this like if I put on makeup put on lipstick and a nice suit this is exactly how I would look and I love this feature of Headshot Pro where you can actually see a preview of your LinkedIn profile how this photo would look on your LinkedIn profile and you can see that in that small circle that you can see on LinkedIn even this AI generated headshot looks exactly like you like there's no way a person would be able to say this is not you there's another way of seeing it as a preview of your email signature like for example if you wrote an email and then you had a headshot in the email 
this is how this would look like and you can customize it by adding your personal details or whatever details you'd like to add um, so this is like headshot pro has all these uh, options where you can even write a sample email you can write your a one line headline one line bio your phone number email everything and you can directly copy it and you can use it on your actual emails which is such a cool feature i love it okay so let's go back to the headshots and show you more of what amazing headshots headshot pro has generated for me so i'll first show you the ones that i like and then I'll show you the ones that I don't like. And I'll tell you why I don't like them. This is pretty amazing. The next photo. See, it looks so good. I'm just in awe of the outfit, the hair, the texture of my skin. Uh, this is me standing near the Golden Gate Bridge. I don't know if this is the Golden Gate Bridge, but some bridge where I look professional. Uh and this is one picture that I used for the thumbnail of this video because I, I love it so much like just before I got a haircut when I uploaded my pictures to Headshot Pro my hair looked exactly like this even the small hair on my forehead my hairstyle looks exactly like how I would um, look if I actually went for a professional photo shoot with a photographer another cute picture so this looks like me for sure uh, one thing which is a little difficult for ai headshot generators in general to capture is your body type i am not this slim i'm not this lean and i have a lot more muscle on my arms but since i uploaded only selfies of my face i'm sure not just headshot pro but any headshot generator would fail in this regard but that's okay because we're only looking for headshots to be used on LinkedIn. For that purposes, these kind of photos are more than okay. They are actually really good because no matter how hard I try, it would be so difficult for me to get such stunning photos in good lighting, good background, my face looking all okay with these all cute outfits. It would be pretty much impossible. Uh, so yeah, you can see the skin texture here on my forehead. It looks pretty natural. Usually AI photos have this airbrushed look, which makes it look very heavily photoshopped. But this one looks like how my skin looks. Uh, there is some texture on the skin. There is some texture on the eyebrows, on the eye makeup. It's not very, it doesn't look super perfect. It looks very real which is a great feature of Headshot Pro. And this feature makes me like this AI Headshot Generator tool so much. This is another picture where it looks close to how I look, just that I don't have a white dress, but I definitely need to buy a white dress because I look so good in it, clearly. <laughs> so yeah, this is another photo. Again, if I had to get a real photo of me click like this, it would be pretty much impossible. Like. It's not very easy to click good pictures. Anybody who has hired a photographer knows the struggle of getting good pictures. So I showed you the photos that I liked. Let me show you the photos that I don't like as much. So this is a picture of me smiling with my teeth out. And uh, as you can see, the teeth are perfect. But if you know me in real life or if you've seen my videos for a while, my teeth aren't as perfect as this. Like I've had few people comment on my YouTube that your teeth are so bad, like get an aligner or whatever, rude comments. I always ignore them, but my smile does not look like this because I do not have such perfectly aligned teeth. But Headshot Pro has given that to me. Also, I never wear jewelry. I never wear necklaces. Like I am... When it comes to jewelry, the max I can do is wear some earrings and a bracelet. That's like only for very special occasions, um, never in general. So yeah, again, that's some detail that this tool would never be able to figure out because, you know, it's difficult for headshot generators to capture you in all your essence, right? Another photo where <laughs> my teeth are perfect, which is not the case in real life. So yeah, so this is something I have observed with Headshot Pro that whenever it 
generates a picture of me smiling with my teeth out it tends to give me the perfect teeth which doesn't look like me at all uh, it's fine i'm not complaining because i have i have already selected like 11 photos which i can very much use on my linkedin profile on my social media on my youtube thumbnails but other than that not every photo is good but then again as i mentioned previously if you were to get an actual photographer and get an actual photo shoot done and if the photographer gave you like 300 photos out of that only maybe 20 or 30 would be usable the rest would be very weird with your hair in awkward positions your eyes closed your smile looking wonky that's the case in every photo shoot so and considering headshot pro is so cheap compared to a real photographer getting 11 pictures that are so stunning in such beautiful outfits in such amazing locations with this perfect studio quality light it is definitely a steel deal so if you are looking for a photo shoot and if you don't have the budget for it I would suggest go for an AI headshot generator and Headshot Pro is definitely one of the best AI headshot generators out there in the market. So this was the fourth episode of AI with Anangsha, a brand new series on my YouTube channel where I review cool AI technology and tools and share my findings with you. If you found this video useful, please share it with a friend so they can learn something new as well. And if you enjoyed watching this and my review of Headshot Pro, please do let me know your thoughts in the comments. Your words motivate me and help me keep going. I'll see you again super soon with another new video. Until then, stay awesome and keep hustling. Cheers!